Hey guys, welcome back to the channel once again. And in this video, we'll see how can you fix ad blocker issue while you are visiting investing.com. So this is going to be very easy, super easy. All you just have to follow the steps that I'm going to tell you now. So first, make sure if you are using any kind of ad blocker, you must disable that in order to make it work because that is an actual plugin which is bothering your system, I mean the browser, to make it work. So if you are using any kind of uh, ad blocker, you must whitelist this uh, investing.com or make sure remove, disable, whatever you want to do, but that is not supposed to be in your system, okay? So this is the first thing that you need to keep in mind. Let me show you in Google that this is really uh, becoming a nightmare for few people because, this, they, because they actually don't know how to fix this. So if I type investing.com ad, uh, blocking issue whatever it is so you can see the post four days ago someone posted like they are facing this kind of trouble while they are visiting this site and uh, uh, investing.com reported that this this is some sort of mechanism they have triggered to few systems so this is because they have triggered to make sure their site comes live with a few ads because that is their earning source so uh, all you just have to clear the cache and then your system will work i mean the browser for that you need to come down to the setting and you just have to scroll down to the bottom and click over the advanced section and it will enable few sections uh, right over to the left down you can see it has a few more um, options so i'll just have to deal with this okay now so now click over the reset and cleanup button and it will show you a uh, restore settings to the original default it means it will revert back to the original state where it was before like when you were using it uh, for the first time so all the settings are reverted back to the default now if you click over the investing.com and try to visit the same now you won't see error anymore so you can see the site is now live and you can do whatever you want search records uh, stats of the stocks and everything so this is how you can fix all you just have to clear the cache and i have shown all the steps that you need to follow to make it work i hope you guys enjoyed this video if it was helpful make sure you like share and subscribe with other one i mean subscribe to the channel and share if it was helpful so thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video Bye-bye.